Hi everybody! Today I'm going to be reading a nonfiction book. Remember, nonfiction means it's not fake, it's not fantasy, these are all real facts. And sometimes when we read a book, we read for enjoyment or fun. Other times when we read, we love to read to learn about the world. So today we're going to be learning about a simple machine, which is a lever which is one type of simple machine. And this book was written by Martha E.H. Russett. Let's talk about the parts of the book. This is the front cover, this is the title, this is the spine, and this is the back cover. When I open it up, I see a page that has the title, the author's name, and the company that published the book. This is the title page. Simple machines, levers. In nonfiction books, you'll sometimes find a table of contents. The table of contents helps us find what we're looking for. So if I wanted to learn about how levers work, I can turn to page 8. If I wanted to learn about everyday levers, I can turn to page 14. Levers help. Work is hard. We need help. Use a simple machine. These tools help us work. There you see the word lever. A lever helps us lift. A lever helps move loads. And here again, you see the word lever labeled. How levers work. A lever is a bar. It sits on a point. So they show you in the picture, here is the point and here is the lever or the bar. Push down on a lever. The other side moves up. Lever. Put a big load on one end of the lever. Push down. Lift the load. So you can see in the picture, the little girl is putting the lever into the ground and then pushing down to lift the load. So these are, a, these are some great vocabulary science words that we can remember, lever and load, or when we're talking about moving different objects or simple machines. Everyday levers. A seesaw is a lever. Push. A friend goes up. You go down. I bet you guys have used a lever before. A hammer is a lever. Pull! A nail comes out. So levers are a really great tool, a simple machine that we use. Scissors are levers. Squeeze. The paper is cut. I bet every single person out there has a lever, some sort of lever at home. We use a simple machine. It makes work easier and fun. Look at this lever. It's a spoon. And normally at the back of a nonfiction book, you'll find the glossary. The glossary helps us um, figure out words that we don't know. So if I don't know what the word lever means, I can look for the definition at the back of the book. If I don't know what a bar or point are, I can look and the back of the book in the glossary will tell me. And we also sometimes see where you can read more about a certain topic. So if you really want to become an expert on something and learn a lot about it and learn some new fancy words, you can read even more. And you can also visit certain websites. So the books not only are for us to enjoy, but they're also to teach us new things. So I hope you guys enjoyed Levers. Bye!